How to create a quiz on Canva. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you on how you can create a quiz on Canva step by step. Whether you're a teacher, content creator, marketer, or just someone looking to engage your audience, Canva offers an easy and interactive way to make beautiful quizzes. Stick around till the end because I'll also share how to make your quiz interactive shareable and even track answers using some powerful canva interaction or integration now let's talk about what is the canva quiz maker canva doesn't have a tool specifically designed or called quiz maker but you can absolutely design quizzes using its presentation website or form template you can add multiple choice questions true or false open-ended questions and even use links to or buttons for interactivity. Canva makes it easy to build stunning quizzes for fun, education, and lead generation. So let's start with our Canva account right here. Right after, you can just go ahead and search for a Canva template. In our case, it's going to be a quiz presentation. You can also type something like interactive quiz right here. But in our case, we are going to search for a quiz presentation. Right after, it will then show us a lot of templates that we can basically go ahead and use. For example, we have this very unique Canva design right here. But to make things easier, let's go ahead and choose something simple from the templates right here. So to make things simple, let's go ahead and pick a simple design. I'll choose this template right here. Click on the customize this template to go ahead and customize this on your own. And right after that, basically inside, we just have to go ahead and change some of the aspects inside the quiz right here. So inside this quiz, we have true or false. You have multiple choice. You have identification. And lastly, you. I think you have an essay right here. So in my case, I'm going to mainly focus on multiple choice right here. So I'll just delete the other quizzes or the other formats for our example. And right after that, we are then going to be focusing on the multiple choice section. Now, the first thing that you want to do is to simply go ahead and customize this since this is the first questions. I'll go ahead and insert question one right here. You then want to insert your question. From there, you then have to input your multiple choice right here. And lastly, once again, you can just customize this the way you want to. So in my case, I'm going to be placing this choices right here on the middle of this boxes. And right after that, let's just navigate through the second page on which we then have to insert the answer of this specific question. So once again, I'll just go ahead and delete the third page right here to make things easier. Click on the three dots to basically duplicate the same page. And once inside, all we have to do is to simply highlight the answer that we have made. So you can do this to whatever you want to, but in my case, to make the design right here beautiful, I'll just go ahead and change the color of the boxes right here. So basically, if we navigate through the next page, it will then highlight the correct answer. Of course, once again, you can just animate this the way you want to, but in my case, I'm going to be doing it this way. So you can just click on a specific box, click on the animate button and from here you then want to simply click on one of the templates animation right here. Now I've clicked on the pan animation, we have the both, but in my case I'm going to animate this on the entry of the page. You have your speed and you have your direction. Now to make the quiz even more better, you want to go ahead and add a transition right here. To do that, you can just hover your mouse between the Canva pages. And from here, these two options will go ahead and show up on which you can click on the Add Transition option. Click on the Match and Move. 
and right after that if we then go ahead and play the transition it will then go ahead and look something like this on which it will highlight our answer or the correct answer and so the only thing that you need to do is to simply go ahead and copy the pages right here so once again just click on the page click on duplicate page and from here you then want to paste this at the third page because we already have our second page animated from here you can just go ahead and insert the question to change the question right here and of course you then want to change your answer once again duplicate the page once more and right after you now want to go ahead and highlight the answer by simply adding some animations or ch changing the highlight of the specific boxes right here once again as you have seen the earlier you can go ahead and do this from an identification true or false and more now to go ahead and save your quiz you can just click on the share button and from here you then want to click on the download option of course we can then go ahead and present this specific presentation or template right here by clicking on the present button click on present and once inside we will be able to present our quiz right here so this is going to be our first page this is going to be a second where we'll get that pan effect and this is the fourth and lastly the fifth now once again you can basically add transitions right here to make things better in my case i'm going to add some generic transitions right here and once again if we go ahead and present our presentation or our quiz it will then go ahead and look a lot better And so let's go ahead and proceed and download this file by clicking on the download button. From here you then want to simply choose the PDF standard and click on the download button. You want to make sure that you download all of the pages inside your quest on Canva. Now once again there are a lot of templates that you can go ahead and use inside Canva right here. But I've only choose the simplest one to make the video understandable for beginners on canva once again you can just search quiz presentation right here click on the see all button and right after you then have a lot of quiz that you can go ahead and use for your designs and so let's go ahead and click on some of the templates right here as you can see this template is fully customized already i think this is also an interactable quiz so let's just go ahead and click on the present button and from here if you click on the start button it will then go ahead and interact with our quiz right here and so with this one it's as simple as editing the preset or template right here you then have to edit your questionnaires and you should be good to go and so if this video has been helpful leave a like subscribe and follow us for more videos like this thanks for watching